Today, I will show you how to delete tweets, retweets and likes all at once. It is totally free, and I do not sell smoke as in other channels that promise you that it is free and it turns out that it has many limitations for being a free user. Without further ado, let's begin. First, we go to the browser and enter the URL redact.dev. Once inside, we download the installer. It is available for Mac OS, Windows 10, Linux, Android and iOS. In my case I will use the Windows version. By the way, I tried to do this procedure on a Windows 11 in a virtual machine and it did not work, it only worked on Windows 10. We proceed with the typical installation of a program. We accept the new firewall rule. We accept the license of use. Before proceeding, I will show you which tweets I want to delete. Now, let's move on. Click on the services button, search for Twitter, select it, and a button with the Twitter logo and name will be added. Click it, and log in with the Twitter account you want to delete tweets. Once logged in, you will have access to a wide range of tools and filters to delete tweets, likes, retweets, etc. You can simply preview your tweets, delete them at once, select and delete or schedule to do a certain action. Now we get down to work. In my case, I will delete tweets that I have generated since yesterday until now. Very important to check what you want to delete, in my case I'll check everything. You obviously filter it in your own way and be very careful not to touch any wrong or misconfigured parameters. Finally I click on select and delete. Although, you can also just delete directly. The tweets I created according to the date range I defined have been detected. I select all and delete them. Once deleted, I go to Twitter and check it. Indeed, the tweets no longer exist. Finally, when you are finished using this tool, you can simply log out. In conclusion, this program is very useful and the best thing is that it is completely free. However, sometimes it doesn't remove or detect all the tweets, especially if you have a large number of tweets, so you have to repeat the process two, three, or even more times, depending on the filter you have configured. I don't recommend the select and delete parameter if you have a lot of tweets, just use the delete button. This is my humble opinion and recommendation. I hope you find it as useful as I did. I had to do a lot of research to find a free alternative, so I would appreciate the thumbs up and optionally subscribe to the channel for more useful content like this. Bye.